We understand surveying data and we understand the importance of accuracy, repeatability as well, so it's all about quality. Our 3D models are made out of what calls a point cloud. Each one of those points you can identify and put attributes to it so you can find a lot about the materials it's made of, the surface types, um, history of that data as well, so they're intelligent. 3D models. Our role in it was really to supply as many data sets as we possibly could for Ordnance Survey for the project. Everything from street lighting and lampposts and, and bus shelters all the way through to uh, the types of tree growing in uh, Horseshoe Common in the town centre of the Lansdowne. The data that we provided to our project partners was really important because it filled in one of the key knowledge gaps in the project. The 5G Innovation Centre partners really worked out how radio waves would transmit around that cityscape. And then the Met Office were able to really drop real weather on top of that, just to show exactly how much that might change if it started to rain really heavily. In terms of the signal propagation, it was really important for Ordnance Survey to be able to understand lines of sight for this project. And obviously, you know, if you have foliage or trees or even hanging baskets in the town centre, that can affect um, how the signal is transmitted. To our knowledge, no other mapping technology would be able to do that efficiently. The Ordnance Survey 3D mapping with a high resolution and fast computing of this information, that was unique expertise that brought into the project. The opportunities are endless having completed this project. Ordnance Survey have got a fantastic opportunity to exploit what we've learnt on the 5G project not just for 5G, but for other initiatives as well. Digital built equipment, connected autonomous vehicles, Internet of Things and um, underground asset. Uh, having good, accurate 3D models just opens up so many doors for the future.